slave labor. How long do you get to go on the boat thing? And do you do it yourself or does he do it? One thing I asked Marla before we came here too is if they have water. Looks like they could have something over there. I don't know. There's a security hanging out. They're very ducks are territorial, at least from my experience in the U.S. A what? Oh, I could have sworn Marlo said, my love, you're not supposed to pass that point, my love. I'm like the rule keeper here. <laughs> this place isn't very old to have missing letters. Farm periods. Wow. Oh. Wow. Yeah. If you guys can see. These are all crabs. Crab holes and crabs. You should try to get a job here, my love. You should try to get a job here. Oh, that's nice. I don't know, it's nice, I guess. It's kind of boring. It's pretty much exactly what I imagined. Uh, this is my first time here. This is like Marla's third time or something, but I don't know if she's ever done this kind of stuff. What? Thank you. What? It's my first time. You've been here before? No. I thought you did pictures here. Well, I guess it's her first time. I could have... She has said the words agria. Agria and like going to Agria so many times. We almost said like we're going to Agria but somehow oh. my friend doesn't go here like this. we're always there. I didn't know that. Similar like those kind of cows my love like in the US. Marla's always asking me what kind of cows we have beef from and you know I can't I have to show her but I think it's like those ones. Can you not, can you get over? Wow, they don't really let you close to them at all, huh? Do you go in there? Yeah. Oh, okay. Like up to the thing? Do they charge you to feed them? No. Wow, they do in the U.S. See, that's how they make their money in the U.S., my love. Something like this. I don't know, 150 to get in. It's only three bucks, but uh, that's each. But... The uh, attractions inside are a little bit more pricey, but 200 to rent the thing, we might do that. The boat over there. 
It's not 200 each, right? It's just like 200 to rent it. Mm, yeah. Three percent. Oh, okay, so there we go. So we'll probably go do that. Especially because it's her first time here. I really did not realize that at all. She didn't say anything about that. I could have sworn she's been here a bunch of times with her friends. There is a, literally like one or two other couples here. That's it. You know, not couples either, like just a few other people here that don't work here. I'm sure, uh, oh my gosh, look at those goats playing. So cute. Look at their, like, the older ones are over there, like, yelling at them. Oh. We feed the dog. I told Marla we're going to take it slow. I'm going to go through all of the things. That's a really nice chicken coop. Look at that chicken house. Mm -hmm. My gosh, this chicken house right now is like better than Marla's house. <laughs> oh my God, what are you doing? Yeah, she's looking at me like she 100% agrees. It's true. This is nice. We have that room. I mean, I'm going to be just totally real here. Hold on, let me widen this. This is how a lot of Filipinos live. No? Mm -hmm. I mean, this actually, this is exactly how my, my first... Uh, my ex's house was inside was uh like a dirt floor like yours at, at your family's mm. not you know no chickens inside or chicken shit but uh just like that like a couple of you know kitchen over here living area here kitchen and uh their rooms up elevated like that i mean it's really nice These chickens are uh, well taken care of, I'd say. At least with their accommodations. Mm -hmm. Plenty of space, too, for the amount. Mm -hmm. I like to see that. This is a really nice chicken coop. I mean, the roof is the exact same thing that we used on a uh, wireless family. Right, my love? Yeah. yeah, really nice. I mean, I, I'm, just, I'm just saying, like, that's the truth. I mean, a lot of Filipinos don't, they all live in something like this. And that's actually pretty nice. All right, next one. I keep feeling like over here we might get like yelled at for coming over here. But there's, I'm pretty sure you're supposed to be. Look how these goats like line up inside their things. Hello. Can you touch the animals? Oh, I don't know. Goats look a little violent. Look at the goats, guys. They're very cute. They're very little. So many babies. I'm so afraid he's gonna come and like get mad at me. That's me making that noise, by the way. I'm hoping I don't get butted by a goat. That would just ruin my day. It's getting warm. We came here where it was a little bit overcast, but uh, it's starting to get warm. Look at this, it looks like a swamp, like in Florida. Like there should be like an alligator. Hmm? Arlo's gonna feed the horses. Please wait your turn. Hmm. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Oh, baby. Yeah. 
What, the whole branch? Very Very crunch, crunch. Uh, all of the horses, or at least Rosie and Drista at the end there, they're both seven years old, and all of the horses are female. I don't know about the others' ages. Uh, they do look younger, though, the other horses that are together. Ruby and Coco. Uh, I was telling Marla, I don't really like the idea of a ride like that. Mm, it's taking a nice big dump. They have a little bit of a delay. But I don't like that because I don't like that animal service thing. I don't like even in, in St. Augustine, Florida, they have uh, horse and carriage rides. I'm against them. I just I think it's unnecessary. That's all. Leave it at that. Marla is super about this bit. I told you not to bring the umbrella. You haven't even opened this thing since we've been here, honey. She just decided to carry this two, it'll, this has to be a kilo umbrella around. Just because it was complimentary. All right, well, I was gonna try to tell you guys about the situation here, because I learned more, but we gotta take pictures of Marla. my picture <laughs> uh, well she's doing a picture of herself I'll tell you what I learned so the reason that it's not complimentary for the agria people that live over there uh, and the ones that it plan on being built over yonder get some use out of this right over here the reason that it won't be complimentary is because this is separate and I don't know the full going ons but what I can guess is this is owned by somebody different. Well, we know that. But possibly a governmental organization like that. Maybe the, in order for them to purchase all of this land, they had to set aside some that was going to be more like environmental. And maybe they chose all this water here because what do they need water for? But uh, over at the horses, the guy, very, very nice and informative. Uh, he told us everything he he could have thought of and I think we're we're getting ready to see what else this place has to offer and maybe even hit the bricks because uh, that's pretty much it the only thing left is really the water thing we're still kind of debating whether or not to do that I'm pretty sure it's a half hour you get okay here we are at Agria, and those letters have really seen their better days. What's up with the letters? Did you notice that, honey? Huh? The letters? I'm just noticing all that. Look at the front. Yeah. 